put all this to the side. I'm gonna zoom you guys in. Because we're gonna do face makeup. Okay, so we're zoomed in now, girl. And we're gonna get our look started. It's a little weird because my camera is a bit further from me, so. But we're gonna do this. I'm gonna go ahead and tie my hair back up. I already have an idea for a look, but I guess before we do the look, we're gonna do some swatches, but I'm just gonna go ahead and tie my hair back up. We're back. <clears throat> All right, <clears throat> so I do have a little bowl with water in it. Um, I'm not gonna be using all that much water, but I do have it handy and dandy. I'm going to be doing a blue look because that is the look that I wanna do for TikTok. I'm not going to be talking a lot. I'm mostly going to be listening to music and doing my makeup. So, of course, you guys really won't be able to hear the music due to copyright, but thanks for hanging out. So I put on my lids just some blue. Ironically, it is the canceled from Jeffrey's and Shane's mini controversy palette. And I think I'm ready. I want to put some dark liner and then come in with the dark shadow that's also in this palette or the shimmer shadow, the simulation. Maybe I kind of want a darker blue. We'll see. And, um, yeah, so I'm going to do this one on camera since it's the first time. Let's see. I'm actually going to be using these brushes that I bought for nail art. I've used some of them, but like this one, I'm not, this one's brand new. So I'm going to use this one. I don't think I've used it. If I have, oh well, I guess. You guys can comment your thoughts below and tell me how crazy it is that I'm going to be using the same thing that I use on my nails on my eye. Okay. So I just got a little, uh, a couple of little drops. Now, mind you, I've used the pink one before, so I kind of know the way it works. And it just starts kind of like watercolor, start making like a little mixture. So you can see where I started making like a little mixture. And now I'm gonna go ahead and line. Let's see how she works. Bitch. Come on, can y'all see that? It just really glided on. I noticed that whenever I, I noticed that whenever I use the pink one that um, it can become like more transparent and less opaque if you put too much water. So at least with the pastel ones, this is so cool. And I've never used like tape on my eyes, so I'm actually just using washi tape. I'm gonna get a little bit more water. Dude, I can see how these would go a long way. I could also see how you could use this for um, like people who do more of like the face painting style. Okay, this is a lot brighter than it looked like on top, which is fine because the blue that I'm using is also very bright. This is so pretty. The 
This is so cute, guys. You can tell when you don't have enough water, it doesn't glide as easy. These are hella cute. Wow. So I'm pretty much in love. So here's what's happening. Comment down below what you think so far. I really like it. It is drying down darker, which we're loving. I think I'm gonna do a little cut crease moment. I did add one baby blue line. My camera ran out of memory, so <coughs> I had to delete some footage off my memory card. But you guys are gonna see how buttery this is. Come on, how do I do this? I'd say it's a little difficult, a little more difficult this side just because, oh, well, just because. All right, so I did put on foundation. I contoured some. I blushed up some. Um, finished the eyeliner. I don't know if I showed you guys that, but um, I feel like I have a full caked on face for sure. Um, I am going to be adding like water droplets coming down with gel liner kind of like paint kind of like the kylie cosmetics little logo or whatever um but blue because i want it to look like water um so that's what i'm going to be working on right now So this is the look. I'm just gonna put lashes on and I think I'm gonna add some sequins or glitter to the water. So I'll be right back. All right, <laughs> I'm back and with this blouse, I look crazy, but um, I did um, put some NYX glitter glue on my lips and then pack on just literally some glitter that I had from Claire's from like forever ago um <clears throat> and then um i did pop a color pop eyeshadow in my inner corner and a nyx where is it at where is it at where is it at it's a nyx um slide on glide on uh eyeliner and my waterline 
And then my hair looks kind of crazy because I did wet it a bit uh, for a TikTok that I made. Um, so you guys will be seeing that soon. Other than the crazy combo with this, what do you guys think? I'm going to get a little bit closer so you guys can have a better look. I will say overall that the gel liners were so awesome. I'm so excited to use them again. I think, um, I don't know, I just really like this look and you might not understand it unless you see my TikTok. So either follow me on TikTok, Vanessa.V or on my Instagram because most times, more times than not, I post whatever I post on TikTok on my Instagram Reels. Um, but yeah, it doesn't make sense, but when you see the TikTok, you're going to be like, yes, queen. Um, so I'm going to get a little bit closer. I will say that from this pack of lashes, I ended up using the faux Mariah and I don't know, like I like these lashes. I mean, I've never tried the Mariah ones. And they're okay. I just think, I just think like I did myself a disservice by not picking the boldest lash, which from this pack would have been the Cassie or the Kylie. So I'm feeling like I could have had a bolder lash to really be in your face. But I'm going to get just a little bit closer so that you guys can take a look at the craftsmanship. Um, overall, I love the gel liners. I'm going to all the colors. Um, comment down below. What do you guys think of the liners? Are you interested in buying any? Um, do you vibe with like the random ass looks? Like, I'm trying to get all artsy on you. Like, let me be artsy. I really like this. I think my favorite part about it actually is the fact that I used tape for my eyes. Not that I didn't know that that existed, but just, you know, I was trying to learn without that or maybe do my eyeliner to cut it. But I do see that it's a totally different vibe when you do use the tape. And um, for that reason, I love my eyeliner. I feel like it just glided and I started here and out and it just glided. Like, it was amazing. I look really crazy. I can't even, girl, if you are still watching the video at this point, comment a clown emoji because that's straight up what I'm feeling. But um, smile now, cry later, bitch. <laughs> it's literally like 3.30 in the morning. I need to go to bed. But you know, once you get invested in a look, you just have to finish it out. So let me get a little bit closer. Okay, so we're up close and personal. So I think overall, like the arches and everything look really good. The wings are a bit off, but that's also because I added underneath here when I was doing that. So that's a little bit of that. But bitch, tell me I don't look good. Like tr try to tell me I don't look good. Let's see if this light cranks up higher. There we go. What do you guys think? Look, look at the strokes. Here for it. Here for it. Oh wait, here's the move. You guys are way too close to me. Okay, here we go. <coughs> All right, so I already finished filming and I actually already took off my lashes, but I forgot I didn't show you guys how it looks with the black light. Okay, this lighting looks crazy, but I needed it a little bit darker so you guys could see. So here it goes. So it's like, if you're at the club, 
turning up your eyeliner wherever you put it it's gonna show I think that's pretty cool full effect boom boom full effect pretty cool pretty cool it's almost four o'clock in the morning I gotta go to bed bye